Okay, so here's some Amazon products that I got. I did use Vipon coupons. So I will put a link to the product description. And I love to have these paint pens. I use them for so much. I use them to paint pumpkins. I use them to paint the details on the rocks and stuff like that. This was a nice set. You have to be careful. Make sure that you're getting a set and not one on Vipon when you're looking because some, sometimes I thought I was getting a set and it was it was one. You'll hear the, the shaker ball. What you do is when you open these and then you're going to press down, the paint comes out. They remind you of the, remember when outliner pens first came out like in the 80s and everybody was like so crazed with them. You had to push down and they were like the greatest thing ever. But these are metallic. So that, that was neat. And they come in a variety of colors. How many do I have here? Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 15. Okay. See, so it even says shake. Whoa. Shake the markers and press the pen tip before use. So they take the, you have to prime them. And you, you can see my pumpkin painting video that I'm using something like that. You get a metallic yellow, a metallic orange, a lake green, a metal green, a deep purple, a metal pink, a metal purple, a metal blue, a dark brown, a metal red, a deep blue, a golden, a white, silver, and black. Okay, and so these are great for a multitude, a multitude of products. So check those out. I will put the, I'll show you how, let me show you how to do one. Okay, so shake it real good. And then you take the tip. Well, these are pretty good. These are like very good to prime. Some are, some take forever to prime. And they're nice because so you see how controlled you can be with them. They have a, it's not a very, I mean, it's a wide tip, but it actually writes pretty narrow. So if you were making details on the rocks, Okay, so very nice. Okay, I will put a link in the video description, but super nice. If you look at my pumpkin painting, I think that's when I show you about priming and some of the brands can be really, really time intensive to prime them. So there you go. All right, let's see what else we have from our Amazon. This for my Instant Pot, for my Melty Pot, my pressure cooker, electric pressure cooker. I have two of them and I'm, I was asked also to do some more recipes in them and of course I'm going to be doing that and one of the things is going to be a cheesecake. So this set came with The, a steamer basket, which is always good to have another one, even if yours comes with it, steamer basket. But it also has a nice divider, so you can whoops, pop that in and have three different items in there. And then it came with this. Now this is... This is a kind of, I forget what, what you're doing on this shirt. 
I have, to, I have to look at what this is because I saw that, but I was more concerned with getting, hang on, the little cheesecake pan. Okay, so this is a little springform pan that fits, it's made to fit right into your Instant Pot, your meal pea pot. Okay, it's just like the bottom comes off, you put your crust in there, you put this on. Okay, and so I'm going to make a cheesecake in there. Gives you a set of tongs. And it also gives you, you know, you've seen me use my egg tray when I was uh, boiling the Easter eggs. It gives you one of those. And so it's a five piece set of accessories. I will put a link in the video description. Now this, I'm trying to remember what this is. What this is, I don't know. I mean, I was mainly going for the cheesecake pan and this is all extra for me. I'll find out what the heck this is. <laughs> to me, it looked like a pasta dryer or something. I don't know. Um, I wouldn't think that it goes in there with the plastic. I think it's something, maybe it's one of those chicken cookers. This could it be to cook a chicken? I don't know what it is. If you know what that is, please let me know. But like I said, this was a set that was a nice little Amazon goodie that I found. Um, what else? Oh, for the glitzy, for the glitzy glamour, glitzy glamour, I picked up uh, one of these. Again, these were all with bike on coupons. This is a backdrop for my, either that I'll use in my photo studio or um, I told you down, down in the basement that we're finishing part of it. Well, it's a semi-finished basement, but I'm trying to get a part of it ready for me that maybe I would do videos or stuff, maybe that I would have this as, I'm gonna have a set of backdrops down there as well, or maybe move my photo studio down there, I don't know. But I just, this was, I got it for less than, I don't know, I think it was less than $9 and it's a good size. But just thought that would be fun. I like to have a lot of different backdrops. So, um, you could even use that not only as a backdrop, but, you know, to photograph on as well when I, I have certain tables that I put out when I'm doing photo picture and that would look nice and maybe we're photographing something on it. So I picked that up. And what else? Okay, guys, so I'll put those Amazon links in there. Thanks for watching.